Hi. Today we're going to talk about doing a quick refrigerant level check. We're going to do our quick refrigerant level check on our C600M and we're going to verify that it has enough refrigerant. We're going to operate the unit in high speed cool for 5 to 10 minutes. Remember, whenever you do a diagnostic on a Thermal King unit, you want the unit to be at normal operating temperatures and pressures. So we're going to let the unit start, we're going to let it do its two minute warm up, we're going to let it go into high speed and we're going to let it run another three to five minutes, maybe longer until we think the unit's at its normal operating temperatures and pressures. And at that time, we should see refrigerant in the receiver tank sight glass. And if we don't, uh, then we know uh, we need to move on to the next step. If the sight glass on the receiver tank is empty, we're going to cover the condenser and run the unit for another one to three minutes in high speed cool. Then we're going to check that receiver tank sight glass again. If we have refrigerant visible in the sight glass, we have enough refrigerant. And if there's no refrigerant available, then we need to add some or do a controlled refrigerant level check. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to let our unit warm up. And then we're going to take a look at that sight glass. Okay, you can hear the unit went to high speed. And because this unit was running earlier today, we're going to call it warmed up. But remember, normally you want to let it run to 5 to 10 minutes to get it in its normal operating temperatures and pressures. Let's go look at that sight glass. Okay, you saw it with me? That's the sight glass. The ball was not floating, so we're going to cover our condenser. Okay, now you can see I have the condensers covered. We're going to let the unit run for one to three minutes in high speed cool, which it is. And then we're going to check that sight glass again. Okay, we saw refrigerant in the sight glass. It says the charge is sufficient for present box temperature. If there would have been no refrigerant visible in the sight glass, the unit may have a leak and lost its charge. Either way, if there's no refrigerant in the sight glass, a 608 mechanic is going to have to take a look at it. Thank you very much.